unique dog breeds at my work part 2. Greater Swiss Mountain Dog. They are a working class breed. They are loyal, family oriented and goofy and weigh 90 to 130 pounds. One time I couldn't lay down comfortably and I was whining a lot. Mom was scared something was wrong with me and called the vet. The vet told her to listen to my stomach for any gurgling. The second she laid her head on my belly I unleashed the most deadliest silent fart I have done today. Show your baby as a newborn versus now. Or my barking has saved mom from being murdered by 17 Amazon drivers, 9 mailmen, 2 UPS drivers, and 1 sketchy looking plastic bag and yet she still remains ungrateful. When your vineyard dog is a 65 kilogram puppy. my dad was bent over changing and I saw an opportunity to get to know him better. With one tiny dart of my tongue he turned into a drama queen and my mom couldn't breathe. Overall I think I learned it a lot. The vet said I'm too fat so mom only fed me dry dog food yesterday. I don't like dry dog food. I was still hungry at bedtime but the bitch wouldn't give me anything else. I had to drink a lot of water just to fill my stomach. I saw mom eating some gummy bears before bed and she wouldn't give me one fucking gummy bear. So I had to drink some more water and mom got mad because she had to refill my water bowl in the middle of the night. I didn't want to piss her off more so I didn't even wake her up when I had to piss all that water out. I pissed in the bathroom just like mom does every fucking day. But mom didn't notice the really nice thing I did for her and stepped in my piss when she woke up. Then she got mad at me again like I did something wrong. Dad was right. There is no pleasing this bitch. You got a friend in me You got a friend in me When the road looks rough ahead And you're miles and miles from your nice warm bed You just remember what your old pal said Boy, you got a friend in me Yeah, boom, boom, ba, 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 then she slept through my class, lucky for her, unlucky for me. 
Then we headed over to the field to play with Kelly's pups. They all love each other and they get along really great. Belle was very happy to see them. After the field, we head over to feed the ducks at the duck pond with my friend and her baby. While he was playing on the playground, we worked on some training. Then we ended off the night with a bone.